हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू मनी लॉ क्लासेस मेरा नाम गौतम दीक्षित है फ्रेंड्स आज का ये वीडियो सारे एस्पेरेंट्स जो अपीयर करना चाहते हैं क्लैट 2022 थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी टू एज वेल एज एल एक टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी टू एंड अदर लॉ एंट्रेंस एग्जाम उनके लिए ये वीडियो काफ़ी इंपॉर्टेंट है वाई बिकॉज अगर हम देखेंगे तो जो जी के है जो जनरल नॉलेज टॉपिक वो अराउंड ट्वेंटी फाइव परसेंट वेटेज होता है क्लैट में अराउंड इतना ही परसेंटेज उसका एल एट में भी है और ओल एट में भी उसका काफ़ी ज़्यादा इंपॉर्टेंस होता है बट वट इज़ द प्रॉब्लम विद जनरल नॉलेज इज कि इट्स वास्टनेस इज टू मच we cannot define that uh, what will be the topics which will be asked in the exam from where the questions will be uh, framed in the examination but to solve this problem especially when you are just less than 3 uh, months uh, before your exam that is clat 2022 which is scheduled on 19 june so money law classes has come up with the video that will discuss the most important gk topics for clat 2022 so here we are going to discuss the most important topics from international national economics then important international organizations reports and indices which were in news from 2021 to till 2022 so let's start with the video so before i start my friends uh, i want to announce that we at manu law classes we have already launched one year and two year course you can enroll today in this course by calling us at 9971444054 or you can visit our website www.lawentranceindia.com friends ab hum baat karte hain we will start with international affairs now why i have selected international affairs first to agar aap clat ke pattern ko agar dhyan se dekhenge last 2 years ka passage based jo hum current affairs dekhte hain to humne dekha hai ki international affairs is one of the very important topic for clat questions aate hi aate hain now international affairs se wo questions aate hain jinka ek legacy issue bana hua hai aur wo jo kafi zyada news mein the legacy issues matlab wo issues jo aaj ke nahi hain bahut purane hain for example agar hum india china border issue ki baat kare so india china border issue it took a new dimension since may 2020 बट ये इशू जो है तब से लेके अभी तक बना हुआ है रिसेंटली फिफ्टीन कमांडर लेवल टॉक वॉज हेल्ड इन चोशुल सेक्टर एंड हियर द डिस्कशन इज गोइंग ऑन फॉर दिस एंगेजमेंट इन गोगरा हॉट स्प्रिंग एरिया सो अगेन दिस टॉपिक हैज कम इन द न्यूज एंड स्टडिंग द इम्पॉर्टेंट डायमेंशन ऑफ इंडिया चाइना बॉर्डर इशू द इम्पॉर्टेंट फैक्चुअल इन्फॉर्मेशन रिलेटेड टू इट इज़ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर योर एग्जाम यू कैन एक्सपेक्ट अ पैसेज नॉट डायरेक्टली फ्रॉम हियर but it may be related to some other issue and some questions can come from here then india china border issue mein aapko thode se larger dimensions bhi padhne padenge jaise ki there are three sectors in india china lsc to usme se pehli baar aisa hua hai ki china is trying to raise the problem in the middle sector which was erstwhile peaceful so all this dimension you have to study then the second important news is that taliban captures power in afghanistan so finally taliban captured kabul on 15th august 2021 so this whole month was in the news related to afghanistan now why this issue is important this issue is important because afghanistan is a country in india's neighborhood and political stabilization is afghanistan is in india's interest so definitely ye topic jo hai exam ke liye bahut important ban jata hai baad mein there are certain dimensions which are related to this topic which you should also focus along with the core issue some of the related dimensions are that you should know what is wakhan corridor you must also study about uh, what is panjshir then salma dam then golden crescent along with that there were certain other issues which was related to india uh, Uh, india is interest in afghanistan so you have to also discuss the role of united nations security council the name of that resolution which was passed for afghanistan then you should also study about qatar agreement between us and taliban and then you have must also study delhi regional security dialogue so these are some of the important dimensions related to the uh, afghanistan news the third news which was in news was 
China Taiwan issue. So we already know that the crux of this issue is a one China policy versus Taiwan's independence. So it all started from uh, 1st November when China started sending fighter jet plane in the air identification zone of Taiwan and it uh, snowballed into a huge uh, geopolitical issue in the South China Sea in the Taiwan Strait. So this is very important issue. Is issue ka jo crux hai, wo related hai. Taiwan ka agar aap historical uh, evolution agar pal lenge ki Taiwan, Taiwan kaise bana, why it is called as Republic of China and why China is called as People's Republic of China and what is one China policy. So agar China ka ye issue agar aapko samajna hai, China Taiwan issue, so you must definitely know what is one China policy. Okay, and then you will be able to identify the crux of this issue, one well, China Taiwan issue. Next is which is very important is Russia Ukraine war. Friends, the issue is very important. On this, I have made a video bhi hua hai, which you can access by visiting Manu Law Classes Private Limited YouTube channel. So, every dimension of Russia Ukraine war is very important. You have to study about NATO, you have to study about Minsk Agreement 1 and 2, you also have to a study about the uh, membership of the European Union, the eastward extension of NATO and then this integration of uh, USSR, what is the agreements means 1 and means 2 and what is Normandy format talk. Then related to this war is also uh, one issue which is called as Montreal Convention. So Montreal Convention which is related to Turkey. Uh, yeah, Turkey state system that is also very important. Now the next important issue is Sri Lanka economic crisis. So we are already doing it that Sri Lanka is facing its uh, economic crisis, balance of payment crisis. There is a large scale depreciation of Sri Lankan rupee and then there are food crisis, power crisis etc. What is the role of India over there and how India is helping Sri Lanka in overcoming this crisis? How much loan India has given to Sri Lanka? how much loan China is expected to give to Sri Lanka, all those topics are very important. Along with that, when you Sri Lanka ka economic crisis, you will also do the fishermen issue with India Sri Lanka and what is the controversy of the island, you will also read it. Then, the other related news with this Sri Lanka is Trincomalee oil farm. Okay, so you have to study Trincomalee oil farm which was developed during World War II. Okay, so India ko abhi pe lease mila hua hai to develop oil farm in Trincomalee. So you have to do that also. Now, like India-China border issue, the next issue is Iran nuclear deal. So if you will know the Iran nuclear deal, so this is again a legacy issue which is happening from past few years. So yahan pe this deal has been revived. We have to study what is P5 plus one country, what is the deal, who is the negotiator in Iran nuclear deal from Iranian side. That name is very important. Okay, and then the dimension of Iran nuclear deal, all those things are very important. Then the related news is study about IAEA, International Atomic Energy Agency. Then we have to study about Quad, then AUKUS, a new security alliance which was announced in 2021. Okay, who are the members of Quad, who are the member of AUKUS, in AUKUS how many nuclear power submarine Australia is going to receive and then who are the members of Five Eyes Intelligence. Then coming to the Central Asia Summit, now why Central Asia Summit is very important because in the backdrop of Afghanistan, okay, this Central Asia Summit was organized on 27 January 2022 for the first time and this summit will be held after every two years and its secretariat is going to come up in New Delhi. So this is very important. Then moving towards Middle East, we have to do India-Israel relation because India-Israel, they are celebrating 30 years of diplomatic relationship. Okay, fine. So that's why it has, it has become important. Along with that, we have to study new quad which was announced whose members are Israel, India, UAE and United States of America. Along with that, South Sudan political crisis where well, Abdullah Hamdo was removed from power and it led to uh, civil unrest in Sudan. So that Sudan political crisis is important than Houthi rebels in Yemen. So what is the issue over there because this news is all this Houthi rebel news is always there in the newspaper. 
so a good information can come from Houthi rebels. Apart from this, some of the other important international issues are Myanmar crisis, okay, and related with Myanmar crisis is Mizoram border issue. Then recently, USA has recognized Rohingya persecution as a persecution against humanity, okay, racial discrimination and violence. So, Rohingya issue has also become important once again. Now friends, moving towards defense. Now in defense, certain important things is Exercise Milan, which was hosted by the Eastern Naval Command of the Indian Navy in Vishakhapatnam, where 46 countries participated. It had two phase, harbor trial, uh, harbor phase and sea phase. So it was uh, first started in 1995. So exercise Milan is very important. Then project 15B under which four steel uh, uh, figures is to be built. One has already been inducted, which is called as INS, Visakhapatnam. Okay. The other three are INS Surat, Mormugao and Manipur. Then project 75I, it was again in the news. It is related to submarines. So project 75 is also very important. Then related with Quad, we have exercise Malabar, where four countries, India, Australia, Japan and United States participate. The first phase of exercise Malabar was held in Guam in Pacific and the second phase in Bay of Bengal. Then BRICS country, Bimstek countries, they organized a uh, humanitarian assistance and disaster relief exercise in Pune called as Panex 21. So this is also very important. Then the next news is S-400 and Kashta. So S-400 missiles which India has procured from Russia, okay, and there was a fear of sanction from uh, USA which is called as Kashta uh, countering American adversary through trade sanctions, Katsa. So this is also very important. It is important from both defense point of view as well as international news point of view. Then the next is India-Russia defense relation. So India-Russia defense relation, India has this year India launched 2 plus 2 dialogue with Russia. Earlier India had 2 plus 2 dialogue only with Quad members. But for the first time 2 plus 2 dialogue between India and Russia was held. So this is very important along with that. A manufacturing unit of AK-203 assault rifle is coming up in Korwa in Amethi in Uttar Pradesh. So that news is also very important. Then there was one appointment which was made that is who is the Indian ambassador to Russia. So that name was also very important. The next coming from the national issues which we have to focus is COVID-19 vaccines and different variants. So friends, this year the news was totally populated by different types of vaccines and different types of variants okay variants which were important was omicron delta ihu these were some of the variants which were in news okay and the emerging one is delta cron okay so variants are important vaccines this time various vaccines have been developed uh covovax corbevax then uh, nova uh, novavax all these vaccines which has been developed they are different types of vaccines we have zykov d which is the world's first covid 19 dna vaccine so new information about vaccine is very important along with that vaccine policy in india that is also very important for example that this year in on march 17th the vaccine policy has included the children between 12 to 14 years of age and they will be administered corbevax vaccine and uh, second is uh, the initiative of Union Health Ministry uh, Har Ghar Dastak to increase the vaccination coverage. Then the next news is Border Security Force. A recent amendment was made in the Border Security Force Act which allows Border Security Force to have its jurisdiction. This jurisdiction has been extended. Earlier it was 15 km from the borders. Now it has been extended to 50 km. Certain states like Punjab and West Bengal they protested against this uh, amendment. But still the act has been passed. The next is Armed Force Special Power Act. This is related to Nagaland ka bhi issue. Hai. And then we have Hornbill Festival. Okay. So AFSPA which is in force in Nagaland. Uh, what happened was that in Moin, uh, as the shooting took place where 13 civilians were killed. Then uh, the central government set up the committee to review AFSPA in Nagaland which recommended 
extension of nagaland for next uh, extension of afspa in nagaland for next 6 month okay the shooting take place around uh, the time when hornbill festival is celebrated in uh, nagaland uh, from 1st uh, december to 10th december okay so this hornbill festival is important the next is the pegasus issue so pegasus manufactured by israeli software company nso it was in news later on uh, west bengal government set up the committee and then it was uh, dissolved by supreme court then supreme court had set up the committee under justice uh, ravindran so pegasus issue is also important important dimensions news about pegasus is that that it is based on zero click okay zero click zero click ka matlab hota hai ki the user will never know that pegasus has been installed then the next was farm laws so yahan pe uh, farm farm laws repeal bill has been passed repealing all the three laws which were in controversy which were in news last year so information about those three farm laws related to contract farming uh, marketing of agricultural produce in markets other than apmc and essential commodities act we have to do all those farm laws then the related news is promotion of zero based natural farming who is the father of zero based uh, zero budget natural farming in india that name is also important then in kerala there was a outbreak of a virus called as nipa virus so information about nipa virus which bat fruit bat leads to proliferation of nipa virus and development of vaccine and treatment for nipa virus is very important then aws quota economically weaker section quota this news was also very important kyun because uh, aws quota was introduced in all india quota of medical seats what is all india quota uh, every state medical seats are divided and 50% of the undergraduate course and 50% of the seats for post graduate co course they form the part of all india quota yahan pe central government ne aws quota introduce kiya which was challenged in supreme court and now supreme court had asked the government to that on what basis rupees 8 lakh income criterion was fixed for aws quota okay now the central government has replied that based on pandey committee recommendation rupees uh, 8 lakh income criterion ensured that there is no under exclusion and no over exclusion so this issue is also very important for our exam point of view the next is uh, economic issues first is foreign contribution regulation act so missionary of charity which was in news that is very important foreign contribution regulation act क्योंकि यहाँ पर सुप्रीम कोर्ट ने सेंट्रल गवर्नमेंट से पूछा भी था कि वाई दिस एक्ट इज इम्प्लीमेंटेड बाय यूनियन मिनिस्ट्री ऑफ होम अफेयर्स एंड वाई नॉट फॉरेन वाई नॉट बाय फाइनेंस मिनिस्ट्री सो फॉरेन कंट्रीब्यूशन रेगुलेशन एक्ट अमेंडमेंट्स व्हिच वाज ब्रॉट इन 2020 थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी दोज आर इम्पॉर्टेंट एंड वॉट वॉज द इशू ऑफ लाइसेंसिंग ओके दिस इशूज आर वेरी इम्पॉर्टेंट देन इन द स्टार्ट ऑफ दिस ईयर दैट इज मई टू a new ministry was formed that is called as ministry of cooperation so uh, we have to study the constitutional uh, schemes related to cooperation the constitutional amendment part 9b and then article 191c which are related with cooperatives and then who is the minister of cooperation along with that we also have to study international cooperative alliance where it is headquartered and other things then the evergreen issue monetary policy and inflation so we already know that we are in the post covid world and we are on the recovery path so monetary policy and inflation both have become very important so in monetary policy you have to study monetary policy committee then monetary policy tools and then what are the inflation types cpi and wpi and what are their rates and how they are fluctuating now you have also have to study what is the forex reserve of india okay some of the current developments related to forex reserve then some of the factual information related to inflation and monetary policy one more term which you have to add while reading this is stagflation then the next is national monetization plan so the government of india dpm department of investment and public asset management is implementing the national monetization plan where the objective is to raise rupees 6000 crore in the next 4 years okay rupees 6000 crore will be used for financing the infrastructure program under pm gati shakti plan and other things fine 
then in pm gati shakti plan a very important plan where 16 ministries will be integrated in a single portal for integrated multimodal connectivity development projects in india the next is national asset reconstruction company limited so this is also very important this bank is also known as bad bank okay and it is going to solve the problem of non performing assets of public sector banks then some of the factual news about narcl that uh, where uh, the government is uh, going to help the narcl in what way okay what is the buyback option etc we have to do in narcl the next is policies and programs which were in news so drone policy 2021 that is in news then air force policy 2021 then upi 123 pay pm portion scheme then national education policy 2020 why it is important because it is a policy which was recently released in 2020 but it is interrelated with many programs and schemes which government is uh, releasing for this years for example if we will look at pm portion scheme which was earlier known as mid day meal scheme now it has been extended to pre primary classes why pre primary classes because it has been mandated under national education policy 2020 then we had a news uh, that the automobile sector is uh, facing a chip shortage so to solve that problem the union ministry of electronics and information technology they came up with the semiconductor mission so that is very important what is the financial outlay what are the components of semiconductor mission okay the next is swachh bharat mission urban 2.0 which is going to focus on solid waste management the next is important indexes and reports friends global hunger index aaya tha badi controversy ho gayi thi isko leke okay so global hunger index is very important then niti aayog has released national multi dimensional poverty index and bihar is the most multi dimensional po poor state in the country so national multi dimensional poverty index is also very important then uh, department of uh, personnel and administrative reform Uh, has released good governance index so we celebrate good governance day on december 25th to commemorate the birth anniversary of late atal bihari vajpayee who was the prime minister of india so good governance index is very important there are category a b hilly states and ut so that is important the next is logistic ease of access among different states index released by union ministry of commerce and industry so this leads index is also very important where gujarat was the top up so leads index the next is indian state of forest report released by forest survey institute in dehradun so according to this report the certain highlights of this report are very important those highlights are what is the what is the percentage of forest and tree cover in india the first thing second is that area wise which state has the highest forest cover proportion uh, of area wise which state has the highest forest cover which state has shown highest increase in forest okay and then along with this some interrelated news which is very important is national forest okay national forest policy the next is world inequality report 2022 which was released by world world inequality lab now this report certain findings of this report is going to be very important uh, a direct passage may or may not come but if the direct passage comes certainly the questions will be asked from world inequality report 2022 this type of topics are also important for alet and other exams the next is international organizations which were in news so shanghai cooperation organization was in news related to afghanistan iran became the new member of shanghai cooperation Organi organization then g7 and g20 it is also very important why because India has entered in G20 Troika. Okay, India is going to assume the presidency of G20 in 2023. Then uh, BRICS is very important. 13 BRICS summit. Then Colombo Security Conclave, which was held recently. So, what is the outcome of Colombo Security Conclave? Who, which is the new member of Colombo Security Conclave? That is also very important. Then FATF Financial Task Force, which has retained Pakistan in its great list and has has added UAE. in its grey list so financial action task force which is located in paris in oecd headquarter so financial action task force is also very important 
then during the Russia Ukraine crisis, India abstained from voting in United Nations Human Rights Council. So, United Nations Human Rights Council is also very important. Uh, then the next is missile technology control regime. Now, it has become important important because of accidental firing of missile which landed in Pakistan's territory. India is member of missile technology control regime. So, it again becomes important. The next is Global Gateways Initiative and BRI. So, the Global Gateway Initiative is an initiative of European Union and is going to focus on development of core infrastructure and soft infrastructure and it is a counter to Belt and Road Initiative of China. So, these topics are very important. Other topics which are important from international organizations are NATO, North Atlantic Treaty Organization, Warsaw Pact and Central Sec Collective Security Treaty Organization. These three are also very important from the exam point of view. So friends, these are the list of 50 topics which are going to be important for CLAT 2022. Make the list, study all the important dimension, study the crux of the issue and study the related information okay this is going to be helpful for passage based current affairs along with that whatever facts you are uh, reading in here make a note of it because that is going to help you in a let exam so friend you can follow us on youtube telegram facebook okay so please write in the comment box about your views related to this video thank you very much